Hey guys, I've had a couple of people ask me how to fix this particular issue that's happening on Final Cut Pro where at random it seems that it just pops up a message asking you to download a font and then you download that font or you skip it and then ask for another one and then another one and so on and it just keeps taking over the screen and it's a real pain in the backside to be quite frank. I tried recreating the problem and I only found one situation where I could and that's where I was totally running out of disk space and what appears to be happening is Final Cut is or, or, the, or the Apple OS is removing some of these fonts that Final Cut needs or perhaps doesn't really need it's it's got them there but a lot of them are Chinese fonts or Japanese fonts fonts that you're probably not using so it I'm assuming deems these as surplus to requirements and then just removes them to free up a little bit of space. So what you're seeing is what I've got here now, I've got this font needs to be installed. So I can go download. Okay, it's going to download this font. No problem. Boom, there's another one. And it's just going to keep going until I skip them all or download them all. And the problem's just going to keep coming back. So an easier way of resolving this issue is, well, first of all, don't run out of disk space. Easier said than done. But the easiest way to get rid of this problem is just to open up your font book and you'll see that the ones that we're talking about here, so this one's like Zinkai, I don't know how to say that, uh, TC, you can see that font is right here. So I think the simplest solution here is to select like all the fonts that are grayed out and then just right click and just say download and it's going to download the whole lot of them and these messages will just simply go away. And it's a lot easier than obviously going through and going click this one, click this one, click this one. Now I know it's not the best solution in the world and I'm still trying to figure out what the root cause of that is, but the only assumption I can make is that the operating system or Final Cut Pro is removing these fonts as their surplus to requirements at the time just to save disk space, but that's a much simpler way of downloading them all rather than going through this process and clicking download for every single time. So if anyone out there has a better solution, please let me know and I'll do a video on that. Uh, otherwise, I hope this helped. So don't forget to subscribe, everybody. I'm going to see you in the next video. You have a fantastic day. Bye-bye.